Hey guys, how's it going? This is Instaviz, and welcome back to the Spirit Mod Let's Play. It has been a while since I recorded one of these, and the reason for that is, well, I'm sure... Like, I, my last video described how my capture card was broken, and, um, that means I can't really rec I can't record any more videos for my Xbox One and Nintendo Switch. I started to do a lot of those more often, because, well, my... PC is kind of a piece of crap. It's a little lacky, it's not really suited for gaming, it's a small Mac laptop, and that's why I stopped making those videos and started to make Xbox One and Nintendo Switch videos. Unfortunately, now that my capture card's broken, I kind of have to resort to making these videos. But it feels good to be back, so please understand why, it's because, yeah, this is like really laggy I bet I don't know how it's gonna come out but what we're going to be doing right now is we're actually gonna be um uh, crafting some things I had to look up what where my progress was last time because I kind of forgot what I was supposed to be doing I don't even know oh no no no, no. I need these I need these so I need one of this one of this I don't know where to put these. Yeah, I can't put that in there. Can I put this in here? No. Oh, I already had some jewel crowns. Alright. Hang on. So I need to... What I need to do is I need to put... Um, what's it called? This, this, and this away. I need to put the dirt blocks in here. And I also need to grab another chest... I like to keep my chests in my piggy bank. And there we go. We heard the human quack. Pleasant. Yeah, I need to head down here. So if this is the miscellaneous chest. Then I need to place this chest right here. And also rename this to miscellaneous. If I spelled it right. I'm sure I spelled it right. And then put this in here. So what we're supposed to do now... Is this Starplate Beacon is supposed to summon a, a crazy boss. And I'm gonna need to do a bit of preparation for this, but what I want to do now is go ahead and take a... A Jewel Crown. And then summon, uh, this Skeleton Bird boss. Now, I kind of forgot how all my weapons worked. Because it's been a while, so... This one does... More damage. But this one fires at a faster rate, only with one less base damage. Oh yeah, the Oak Heart, Melee, a Coil Blaster is a fast gun, I think. Yep, and then this is just a foreign ring. Okay, so I think we're ready to summon this boss. Yep, I, I'll, I just need a drop from this thing. I just need to fight it. I don't even know where it's going. I had an easy time with this boss last time. So I better not have a hard time right now. I don't know what's going on. Oh, does this pierce? Oh well, I'll just cut back. There we go. Defeated. And we got some fossil feathers. Now, what did I need that for again? Oh, yeah, I forgot. I needed it to craft this, but we had already crafted it. Oh well, that was kind of useless. Oh well, I'll just deal with it. Now, the next order of business is we need a special bow. We get this bow from Harpies, and it just has a rare chance of dropping. We're just gonna try to obtain this bow. Alright, let me get back in the sky. We're in the sky. And now all we need to do is just to wait for some Harpies to come along so we can kill them. We're trying to get a certain bow. Hey, what are you doing here? You're not a Harpy. Oh well. Um, we're just gonna chill here and we'll meet you back. I got it! It's the Star Spray! I'm outta here! 
Okay, okay, what 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 do we got? What do we got? So I think we need to head to the Actually no, we need to visit a demon or crimson altar. No, my only crimson is all the way to over here. Um Yes, right here. We're gonna go to it. Also, I have a campfire here. Why is it turned off? I don't know, I'm gonna go ahead and turn that on. But yeah, now that we have the bow that we need, uh, we need to go over to um, the crimson and um, just craft this bow that we need. Uh, because we need to craft it at a demon slash crimson altar. So we'll meet you back. Here's some altars right here. So we're just gonna go in here and craft the night sky. Uh, an annoying night sky? Ah, oh, come on. Okay, what does this bow do anyway? How useful is it? That is pretty useful. I like how it sprays out stars occasionally. And yeah, that... What is that fire? Occasionally shoots on arcane feathers. So yeah, I think this bow is better. We'll have to get you out of here. And then completely reorganize our inventory again until we can find a better weapon. Actually, yeah, why don't I go ahead and look for a replacement weapon? Um... What, what do we have? What should we do? I'm just looking for a, something that can replace that. Maybe we can replace it with the weapon we just got rid of right here. Oh my gosh, there's so many other weapons I forgot we even had. There's so many. It's so awesome. Now, what should go in what order is my question. I think we'll just put this right here. Yeah, I think I like that rearrangement. I think I'll put this right here. There we go. And now, yeah, this bow is pretty sweet. Um, maybe we can craft it into something better. I wonder how many Hellfire arrows we can get. Um, where, where, where? Ah, yes, right here. We can craft to this guy. We can talk to this guy right here. What? I, I could have sworn you sold Hellfire arrows. I don't know what conditions we need before we can sell those. But what about you? Nah, you're boring. You? Just regular arrows. Okay, how many fallen stars do I have? I bet with a lots and lots of fallen stars, we can craft lots and lots of jester arrows. Okay, you're in the way, Dryad. Yeah, see? We can craft lots of nice jester arrows. And I say spend all of them on jester arrows. There we go. I guess we'll go ahead and take the gel out and put it right here. So what else do we have now? I think our next order of business should actually be to fight this boss that is summoned right here. The Starplight Beacon. We're gonna go ahead and put our um, pickaxe away, our old pickaxe right here. Wait a second, what? Hang on. Yeah, there we go. And then put our old bow in here. And now I'm going to be doing some preparation to get ready for this boss that we're going to fight. So we'll meet you back. Guys, it's almost nighttime. I got my arena ready. I got my potions ready. And I got my bow ready. I reforged it because it had a bad reforge. Now all we got to do is wait for nighttime to come. And I'm sure it should come any minute now. I heard this is like a worm boss, and I'm ready for it. All we gotta do is wait. And wait some more. Come on. And yeah, there is a slime rain going on. Which is a huge shame. It was a little annoying, but not too much. It's weird that there's a party going on, but no one has any party hats. Okay, I know nighttime is almost here. 
I didn't cut it to here for no reason. Come on. I can see all the stars. Yeah, it's getting pretty dark right now. I don't understand. The traveling merchant even departed. I. There we go, here we go. This music! You can't hear it, and I have to explain why you can't. I'll explain it later, alright? Oh, that was close. It got defeated, but look at my health. I don't know. I kind of came a little unprepared. I didn't really know what to expect. I'm lucky I killed him, though. But where are his drops? There they are. No, that those aren't his drops. I don't know where his drops went. And I need to find them. But that was super close. And I'll do a bit of um, explanation on the music thing as well, as soon as I find his drops. Ah, uh, I have no clue where they went. And if I log out, then there'll be nowhere to be seen. Ah, huh? oh, come on. There it is! I see his stuff! It's all the way down there. You see it? In the bottom left corner? I was just digging around, seeing if I could possibly find it, and there it is. Alright, now we just gotta get to it. I'm gonna dig straight- Okay, now I'm gonna give the exclamation as to why you can hear the music, so... For some reason, my mic audio is always glitchy. When, um, uh, you can get out of here. My mic audio is always glitchy whenever I try to, like, record the system audio and my microphone audio at the same time. Whenever I try to do that, like, my mic audio just comes out really glitchy. So that means, um, I'll have to prioritize either recording game audio or mic audio, and I chose to record mic audio. So I'm just editing in music and stuff. And here's the thing. For some reason, on my computer... The custom music for this mod comes out really glitchy. Like I already said, the computer I own is a piece of crap and I need to upgrade really quick. That's why I've been recording um, console videos a lot. We got a sweet magic weapon though. So yeah, I need to upgrade my computer fast. So, what can we craft? We just need to come at this and build. So, my current armor does 8, 9, 8 for defense. There was this other set of armor I wanted to craft that I get from these drops. Yeah, see. I have enough, I think. So, 4 plus 5 plus 6 should be 15, I think. Yeah. Wow, I have exactly enough. Okay, so, star plate chest guard. Uh, and then Starplate Crown and Starplate Leggings. So this this whole armor set gives one more defense than my Molten Armor set. I don't know if there's any cool weapons we can craft though. Hang on. Nope. So what did I just craft? I crafted the Leggings. And now I'm gonna craft the Chest Guard. And now the Starplate Crown. Awesome, and I get some extra life. 420. Um, yeah, so this increases damage by 4%, maximum life by 10. This reduces damage by 3% and increases maximum life by 10. 
and this increases movement speed by 5% and critical strike chance by 4. And the set bonuses reduces damage taken by 5% and leaves a trail of electric stars where you walk. And it destroys things. That's awesome. Um, I think to end this episode off, we're going to enter hard mode. That's right. We're going to go down, kill the wall of flesh. Shalmu's boss, all right? We'll meet you back in hell. We are in the underworld right now. It's pretty big, that's for sure. Huh. All right. I guess it's time to get building this bridge. What the heck? I just killed something that I'm not sure what I killed, but it gave me almost five golden coins. But I didn't get to check what its name was. I just killed it in one swing, but it looks like a rare mob. I'm not sure what that was. Oh, well, back to building. There's the mob again. What's it called? Forgotten One. It has very low health. It only has five health. And it gives you tons of money. I'm assuming it's a really rare mob, but I just didn't get That's my second one, so I'm not sure what the quirks of it are. Like, maybe how much... Maybe it does a lot of damage to make up for its really low health. I'm not sure. Oh well. We'll cut back to when this darn thing is done. Here we are to our final blocks. 210. Now, is there a pool of lava below here? Yep, there sure is. And it's one of those mobs again. Alright, there we go. Everything's good in the world. Now, let's go ahead and destroy this wall of flesh. There we go! This, wow, this ash is actually kind of getting in the way. Oh well. Come on. All right, I'm not. I'm not. I'm gonna try not talk. I'm not really gonna talk for the rest of this fight because I need to focus. There we go. Also, a blood moon is rising. That was a message given to the earlier. The ancient spirits of light and dark have been released. Here we go. Wow. Ball of flesh? What? Um. Okay. I'll have to check out what these items are all about. Oh, we got a warrior emblem. I forgot about the emblems. We need to make an adventure emblem. Crimtain blocks. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, you're interrupting my moment. Um, it's a summoning damage. Wait, so... Okay, I need to go home. This is too much. Alright, here we go. So now, Ball of Flesh, 38 throwing damage. Oh, that's a map I've never seen before. I'll just stay in here. Drew? I'm sorry, but I don't remember you. Who are you? Huh, he must be some NPC that I never knew about that came here. Huh, okay. There's a blood moon going on, and I need to check out what all these new things are. Oh, it's an, it's infinite. Alright, so we'll have to replace that with the Floran ring. Yep. Oh no, the witch doctor's gone. Yeah, this is interesting. Alright, there's so many things going on right now. I'll have to rearrange everything. Uh, okay, what else is this? A Famine Skepter. 24 summon damages, summon damage. You, summons a hungry minion, minion to fight for you. 
on you. Alright, um, I'll just have to rearrange everything right now. Let's test out this weapon. Ew! A hungry is attached to me! Alright, this is interesting. Well, we'll have to end the episode here. I'm glad we got some nice progress done, and once again, sorry for the lag. I need to start recording PC videos again now that my capture card doesn't work anymore. Who knows, maybe it'll fix itself in the future. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of the Spirit Mod. If you did, leave a like if you want to see more. Subscribe for more content like this. Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.